tap, 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 tap. That means the, the sound is on. We're in. We're locked and loaded. And welcome, everyone, to a stream by yours truly, Logan. I'm going to be conducting it, probably not unlike Frasier, from the show Frasier. Never watched I'm, that show, actually. Neither of neither is Thomas. Oh, okay, well. <laughs> I am joined by Thomas's friend, Kenny. Kenny! Greetings. How are you doing today? I'm actually doing very well. This is the first time getting to do something like this with you, and I feel very excited about With this. me, yes, with me, yes, because you've done it with some of my counterparts. Exactly. Um, Patton, in particular. Yes, this is wonderful to be here. I get to run my first live stream. Uh, this is great because I get to really prove that I can be efficient and I know exactly what we're going to be doing. And I was a little bit late on time, but only five minutes late. You know what? I, I'll, I'll, I'll forgive it. There is a lot of people in the stream saying, hi, Logan. Hello, back to you. Salutations. <laughs> oh, we have a, uh, what is this? A super chat? Oh. There, yeah, super chat. It's where people want to send you messages uh, from a donation. username Hello. Hello. Am I, and I hope I'm pronouncing that correct. I don't know yep, if that's right. that's Serbian in uh, in origin or I, I I guess absolutely interesting. But it says Logan, you're my favorite. Hi. Well, that's very sweet. That's very very kind of you. Um, we are going to be playing the game Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Yes, based off of the popular TV series. Based off of the popular TV series that started in 2001 with Regis Philbin. Yes. It ran for approximately 22 years as it is still currently going, correct? Oh, absolutely. And <laughs> just, I'm glad that you're going with, with different hosts. these factoids. Um, with, and I do, I am correctly using that word factoid because I don't know if that information is correct or not. Sounds uh, right to me, though, in the content. We have another super chat here from Zero. Hi, Logan. Hi, Kenny. Good luck on the games. I'm so excited to be here. I oh, love you. This wow. will be fun. I, I appreciate that. I appreciate the love, the kindness, and the support. Thank you all for joining me on a wonderful Friday. If you're in America, tomorrow is Veterans Day. So some of you may have plans. And for you to take time out of your day to join us for this Veterans Day weekend, yeah. I appreciate it. Happy Logan Late Appreciation Day. Thank you, Reggie Black. Thank you it for using the Logan correct terminology. Day. Yes, uh, some of the sides, Roman, Patton in particular, they like calling them birthdays, and I've I've always had a problem with that, but up until very recently, the past couple of years, people within the community, as well as the sides, have changed it to Logan Appreciation Day, and that I can get behind for their, their silliness. Now, let's go ahead. We're going to move in forward with the game. Yes. I want to see I want to see what this is going to be about. Now, have you ever played Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I have once, and I enjoyed it. Okay. It really stimulated my knowledge on not only basic education, but also current events, uh, popular entertainment businesses, and sometimes topics involving science, math, sometimes history of all kinds. Wonderful, wonderful. And, and Kenny, I must say I do appreciate you changing and tweaking your personality to adjust to whichever character that you're doing live streams with. That Speaking is of that, very nice of you. I will be right back. Oh, You go ahead and start the game up. And do I, I just press play? I press play right here. Press play. And I'm pressing and actually, play. actually, while we do that. And we're pressing other things. It's loading now, so we'll take a little bit. Wonderful. Wonderful. And while we're doing that, while we're waiting for it to load, we've got a couple of other super chats here. Uh, hello from Warner Dude. next time. Hello, Logan. I hope you're doing well. I'm putting off a lesson plan for students. Ooh, you're a teacher. That is wonderful to know. Um, I'm going to go up here. There is a number of people that just came through with Super Chat. So now I have to go back up and I'm pressing with the right side button. I'm sure you're disappointed. <laughs> uh, I I think that for the sake of Thomas's lesson plans and, and abilities to uh, um, conduct his affairs, you're actually doing exactly the right thing in, in my mind. So thank you so much, Ashley. Um, I love you and have a good stream. I care very much for you too, Ashley. Wow, there is a lot of co uh, coming in. You are very much loved today. Uh, apparently there is a lot of Logan appreciation happening right now. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Uh, we have one from um, Duck with a Top Hat, I think. So thank you for that. Their first Their very super first chat. Thank exactly. you so much, Duck with a Top Hat. I do appreciate that is a silly, silly, ridiculous imagery. Um, and Captain Cosplay, thank you for your su first super chat. Happy birthday, Square. And you said happy birthday. I will let that slide. So thank you so much. Uh, MC Prism, YouTube. Hi, Logan. I'm a huge fan and you are so cool. Thank you, MC Prism. That is wonderful. I never tire of hearing that because that is something that I don't often get called. 
by any of the other sides. Uh, Evan says, hi, Logan and Kenny. Hope you guys have a lot of fun. Thank you so much, Evan, and I hope that you enjoy a game full of learning. Zoe Murtog says, hello, Logan. Love you to see you. Hope you had a nice appreciation day. Odd question, what makes you laugh? Oh, uh, hmm, I don't know. Probably cynically I'll laugh at things. I'll probably, if I were to watch Frasier, I probably would laugh at Frasier. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, you jokes, that's sir. just a hypothet. That's just a hypothesis. Um, I love that this chat keeps refreshing itself, so yeah. I, I lose track. Well, you also have this up here. I do have this up here, but I didn't know if it was cutting off some of the words. Hi, Logan. I just started a tattoo apprenticeship. Polaris Ooh. and the Bees. That's awesome. That's quite fantastic. Uh, well done. Please stay safe. Please be appropriate. And best of luck with your endeavors. And Princey Alex, there, Super Chat. Hello, Logan and Kenny. My plushy Logan says hello, and I also, a Logan, to be exact, also say hello. Triple Logan. That is, a, Logan. That is a Logan, 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 triple Logan. Nice to see you, Princey, Princey Alex, Logan Alexander. Captain Sam says hello. Logan wanted to let you know that you truly have a very positive effect on my life. Don't tell the others, but you're definitely my favorite. Captain Sam, I won't tell the others um, because I know that that would completely devastate them. Thank you so much, <laughs> Captain Sam. All right. Uh, and then we also have a few more here. We've got uh, Eclipse Plays. Hi, Logan. How are you today? I'm doing very well. I'm yeah. ready. I'm ready to play some games. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Minecraft Crimson Biome says lots of love from Wales. Ooh, wow. Far away. It's got to be beautiful where you are. I sure hope so. I wish that Thomas would take more trips to far off places, and that would be one of them for sure. Jade says, hello, Logan and Kenny. Hope you're both doing well, being productive while watching this stream. Hey, that is wonderful to hear, Jade. Thank you for being pro productive and multitasking. That's always something that um, makes me very excited. Um, oh, and then we have one more. No, Nat is a nerd. Logan, are you sure this is the best use of Thomas's time? Well, either way, can't wait to see where this goes. Well, he's, he's attending to his work. Strangely enough, this is his business, and he is attending to his work. And he got done with a video that is going to go up tomorrow, which is the pilot episode of a new series called My Roommate is Hades. It's a pilot episode. So we'll see tomorrow, but based off of response, if it will continue. But he thinks that if, it, if people like it, then it will be turned into a miniseries. That's that's the whole. That hope. sounds awesome. Yes, and uh, it, I know that Thomas is very excited about it. Roman's been flying off the hook about it, <laughs> and so yes, very much looking forward to it. The premiere for that is tomorrow at 11 a.m. Eastern time, and that video will be there. The Warrior Store says, "How positive are you getting a perfect score?" Oh, I can't claim to know everything, but I am definitely going to try. Let's go ahead and go in with the game, and then we will yes. attend to some of the super chats later. I Let's was not see. anticipating so much support. Thank you all so much for this encouraging. Uh, support. Thank you. Um, we're going to United States. This is oh, yep. they have different shows. They have different versions of the shows oh, here. So really? I'm going to stick with the United States. It's oh, what use this it's here. what I know. Oh. oh yeah, you're good. I did what I did. Yes, you did what you did. And we're moving on. We're moving forward. All forward right. and on. Let's do this. Pressing play. Choose a game mode. Okay, uh, well, we'll do solo. Solo for now, together. and then maybe we could do multiplayer. Oh, we're working together. It's a team yeah, effort. Yeah, it's a team effort. Normal. We're gonna be millionaires together. That's work. That's perfect. Ooh. With timer, without timer. Well, the original Who Wants to Be a Millionaire did not happen with yes, a timer. That's right. So it didn't I'm just going to say without timer. I agree. Ooh, oh, awesome. is this who you were playing as, Kenny? Maybe. I've got to say, I do not see the likeness. I don't either. I'm not that old. Um, all right, so we get to choose our themes. We get to choose yep. what we would be good in. Yes. Where's the Doctor Who category? I think you unlock that later on. There is a category for that? There is yes, Doctor you can Who? unlock uh, categories as you progress in the game. My goodness. Um, but we're covering everything. That's yep. what we're covering. I think this would be just I fine. gotta say, don't really feel confident with sports being up Well, there. we can uh, take that off, too, if you oh, want. We're going to take it off, and yeah, I don't know perfect. if anybody in this chat is going to be very upset oh. that we're taking sports off. <laughs> All sports. I mean, some sports... Oh, not soccer. Yeah. There's a whole category just for soccer. Um, <laughs> I'm going to keep this one up, just because we're going to play fair, and maybe sports also includes board yep. games. I know I'm a I fan mean, of board sounds, games. It sounds about right to me. Okay, we're gonna keep going. Um, oh, you get to pick a character. We Ooh. pick a cat. Oh, wow, this is perfect. Well, this individual already closely has the glasses, and I do appreciate this. Okay, oh, they're, they're well, he looked very professional. I yes. do appreciate that. Oh, Massimo has a very tasteful mustache. Or Massimo, I'm not quite sure. Yes. 
Oh, well, I, I like, uh, I, I, I appreciate the combination of what looks to be down to business while being smart. Yes. So, and he's a caregiver, wonderful. Passion, ancient art. Well, never would expect that. George, George won me over. We're going next. All righty. Um, Glitch Wolf, thank you for the super chat. Hi, Logan from Alaska. Ooh. Wow. I, I wonder I how cold Alaska. it is at this time of year. Please, Alaska's Glitch Wolf. Alaska's always very cold. Let me know your summer. information. I would really appreciate that. Mr. Bops and Boop says, it's football, not soccer. Well, we have some Europeans in our chat. There you go. We do have, that is a very contestable topic. Press any button to continue. All right. I remember this. Back to my childhood. This is Watch a very, yeah, this is a very clever song. It's not as good as the rainforest rap, but you know what? We'll let it slide. We'll let I it mean, slide. Just listen for next time show. Make sure you use the tropical rainforest rap song in your next. Video. Yes. I'm just saying. Thank you, Zoe, for that clarification on your the pronunciation of your last name. Millionaire. Oh, that is not Regis Philbin, and that is not any of the subsequent hosts. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for having me. I'm I'm excited to try my luck. Are you ready? All right, we're going to help him let's be a millionaire. Who wants yeah, to be let's a millionaire. All right, let's do it. Let's try our hand at this. Let's see. All right. You know There's the so many questions. I did forget about have, that. And we do have <laughs> lifelines. <laughs> we have We have lifelines. Yes. Sparrow Sage, it's, it's nice to see you as well. And you hope things go well for tonight with the game. Love you tons. Stay cool. Thank you so much, Sparrow. Switch the question. I don't remember Switch the Question. Switch the Question is a more recent yeah, lifeline. I like that. In the English language, which letter nearly always follows the letter in the word? Well, okay, so we just need to know our basic ABCs. Yes. The common $100 question, pretty easy. Oh, I um, feel like it could be you. Like question and question. Oh, 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 and... which, okay, oh, yes, yes, yes. So I D, think... so you. Yeah, I feel like it's you. I'm choosing D. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought they were asking in the ABCs oh. what comes after Q, and I was very surprised not to see an R here. <laughs> That's okay. That's why we're here working together with our knowledge. I'm sure we can get through. And we this. double we double click to make yes. sure that we're right. Okay. And now to the most important question oh. of all. We Is click it this again. Is your final answer? Yep. Yes. That's my final answer. That is our final. The answer. voice acting is wonderful. Find out the oh, absolutely. <laughs> Oh, we have some U's in the chats. Yeah. Our U's well are correct. You well done to everyone right in Easy. the chat. Easy. Well done. Well Easy done. $100. Almost. Easy 100 Easy 100 Easy 100 I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. <gasps> Someone who behaves oddly is said to be mad as a what? Ah, mad as a potter, mad as a hatter, mad as a rotter, mad as a hitter. Now, I do have a note card on this, and it is mad as a hatter. I'm choosing nice. you agree? I agree. I absolutely agree. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? You are not my Regis Philbin. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> not uh -huh. my Regis Philbin. Don't appreciate I that. Vote for him. Captain Cosplay says, Logan, you remind me of the 11th Doctor. Now, you that is surprising that you would. I would remind them of the 11th That's Doctor. It. 11th I Doctor always behind. felt a little bit more playful to me. That's I feel like I'm not That's as perfect. playful as the 11th Doctor. But oh, thank you, not. nonetheless, to be compared to any doctor is an honor. For this new question. Oh, where's Roman when you need him? Don't worry, I got you on this one. Okay. Let's see. In which Disney film are the title's character's ears so big that he can use them for flying? Pinocchio. Mm, Pinocchio, close. final answer? Pinocchio was the one that grew... Oh, nose Big Nose. Big I'm nose, tired yeah. of these Disney characters <laughs> with their two big body parts. Uh, we're going to go with Dumbo, because Dumbo was the one who was yeah, the No more the hesitating. Ears. Well, I'm gonna say D. I don't believe you, but you we're going to go ahead and <laughs> right? secure hey, that answer. I have glasses on. Answer? I think I know what I'm doing. You're right. Yes. I got these because it makes you smart. Is there right? is no correlation between glasses and intelligence, but I do but appreciate you comparing made. yourself to me. But Thank the, you, Kenny. That's what the internet Moving said. on, we have um what are uh, other right chats? Answer? Awesome. Ooh, Glitch Wolf. 30 degrees Fahrenheit. We're supposed There's to get no more question. snow, rain, home. Oh my goodness. Power to you, Glitch Wolf. Stay warm in Alaska. Oh, congratulations to those that answered the correct quest, correct answer there. Nicely done. According to the saying, what does one good turn deserve? Another. I have another note card about oh, this. Yes. I really appreciate all these questions having to do with um, aphorisms. <laughs> um, <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I'm going to. Would you agree on this? I think that sounds right to me. Final answer. And if not, then you it sure? was worth a try. That's my um, final one answer. One good turn deserves a falsehood. Star says. 
Interesting. Now it's I will do a falsehood at the end of the live danger. stream. Yes. I know that a, a lot of people do ask me, ask for that. Very good. You got Nicely it. done. Well, well, well done to everyone. We all around. Well done to everyone. So let's move on to a whole new question. Nerdy Corn says, going to school to be an x-ray tech in January. Oh. Any words of encouragement? Wow, Nerdicore. That move. sounds very ambitious. I really hope that you uh, have a lot of fun and maybe sneak some things Come in on, there George. that you just would like Focus. to x-ray on your own out of a hobby. You know, I've always wanted to see what's on the inside of a sandwich. Oh, yeah. You know, when you put the crofters on the bread and the two pieces of bread, don't you want to just x-ray that to see what it looks like in between the two pieces of bread? Well... What maybe. Jedi Master trains young Ezra Bridger in Star Wars Rebels? Ooh, that is one show I didn't now, watch. I did not entirety. watch Star Wars. But so what do we have here? We may need to use we might, a lifeline. We might need to use a lifeline, but also we have our own lifeline, which is these chatters over here. Does oh, yes, good it, idea. Did anybody, did anybody watch Star Wars? Let's find out. Will Cummins says, canon. Uh, let's see what That's, the chat uh, says. Mark, Mark the King says, canon. So we have a number of canons. So we're gonna, we're gonna go with the chat. We're gonna go with the chat. All right, thank because you, I gotta be honest with you, this looks like a bunch of jumble of letters. I mean, all of them. you're not entirely wrong there. there. <laughs> I'm just gonna say. Oh, yes, that's my final answer. George looks like he watches Star Wars. Yes, oh, George Lucas. Can't wait to George see Lucas, the correct yes. Answer. All right, let's see what it is. He can't oh, wait to see the hey, correct thanks, answer. Hey, thanks, chat. Thank you, chat. Thank you so much, job, chat. You got me through I'm to the other side. Our team of editors offers you a new question. Oh, well, good. Well, thank you to the team of writers. Um, who kills the parents of Dick Grayson, the first Ooh. Robin? Now, this is very tricky because it depends on who you ask. Right. Uh, so in the movie, now. it was Two Face, but in the comic books, which I'm assuming that's what they're going for. It was a mafia group, but I forgot what his name was. So there are two. There are two mob groups in Batman. One right. is Falcone. Car Carmine Falcone is definitely one of them. Joe Chill, I believe, was the name of Jack Nicholson's version of the Joker. Right. And I don't believe he killed uh, Dick Grayson's All parents. right, chat, help us out here. So, we have, what do we have? Oh, we have somebody, Kira is saying Joe. We do have um, lifelines in case we need it. We do have lifelines. I'm I'm really leaning towards Carmine Falcone, but I also don't want to. I don't want to get it done. You know. Right. I don't want to. You want to try? You want to try a lifeline? Yeah. So, go ahead. And do we want to do a fifty-fifty, or do we want to? What let's, would we? Let's ask the audience. You want to ask the audience yes, on this question? Well, mostly because the audience won't know too much on the later questions. No? They'll know more on the earlier questions like as of right now. So right. the chances of getting it right is right. a lot better. Okay. I, at least from experience I've been seeing. Great. All right. Well, so let's, let's make that happen then. All right. Cool. So let's move this right here and go doink. For a few seconds, the audience will vote. Here we go. Good luck. What do we got? What do we got? Oh. oh not, it wasn't what I not expected. What I, well, we, and we do have a number of Tonys in the chat. Well, we so should. either the, we have people in the chat who knew it, mm. or we have people in the chat that Googled. And I'm not going to, to say oh, which one was which. Joe Chill killed Batman's parents in yes. the Telltale series of Batman, so. That makes sense. All right, so we're gonna go with Tony Zuko. All right. It sounds like a character from Greece. It kind of does, actually. But we're gonna go with it. I'm choosing C. And hope that we're okay, okay with this. All right, answer. George Lucas, don't let us down. That'll be my final answer. <laughs> You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. I do too. <laughs> this, what is this? That's this chat, is. this chat feels That's like it was right. written by AI and it's really one bad AI. One more right answer I for really me. I really hope that's not the case. Oh, boy. It's the most generic. Like, will be asked I, I know that I'm sometimes now. told that I have dry co communication. Mm -hmm. They have dry communication. Ain't I at true. least have a little bit more. I'm gonna take this back to the other sides and tell them <laughs> You want to see what dry sounds like. Come on, George. There you go. Focus. What should Muslims do between sunrise and sunset during Ramadan? I believe it's fast. I believe it's fast, too. Yes. I have a Muslim friend who does this from time to time, and they fast on a certain holiday. Okay. 
I feel like it is fasting. You want to go with fa fasting? Oh, we've got another super chat from Gorlick Bread. I'm sorry, you misprint, you misspelled Garlic Bread. Um, hi, Logan. Doing finals right now. Good luck with the game. Thank you so much, Ooh. Gorlick Bread. And I hope that this exam is not in spelling. Best of luck with the Um finals. We're gonna go with fasting. Yep, let's do it. Gotta go fast. I think that the right answer is B. I love that. B. Thank you. You seem to be convinced, but is this your final answer? All right, looks like we were on the right track. Very um, nice. See. Glasses that's do my help final answer. Smart. Told you. Maybe. I, I think it might just be our brains and yeah, not the glasses. You know what? I like that. I like that too. Yeah. Nice but, you are right. but you know what he could use is a bow tie. Is a, is One a tie. right answer I found agree, easily. Actually. Necktie. Or necktie. Almost. I mean, clip bonds will work if you don't know how to tie it, but I won't tell anyone. So happy you're getting into British game shows, Logan. Best of luck from the UK. Yes, Olivia well. is correct. I have definitely done Only Connect is a very is a popular one with Thomas. Um, there's also other ones like Taskmaster and Would I Lie to You. Right. Complete the title of the Hemingway novel, uh, A Farewell to... to Arms. Really? Mm -hmm. And strangely enough, it is not about somebody who is um, saying goodbye to both of their arms. I would imagine that, actually. But, uh, honestly, to... I wouldn't mind looking into new uh, books, so this one I may have to look into. Are you Hemingway. Sure? Uh, yes. James That's says, hi, Logan, you're answer. one of my faves. Guess the other. The oh, well, thank me. you, James, for your initial super chat, and my guess would be Virgil, yeah. most likely. Right. That's usually a safe bet with favorites. One more right I mean, answer for me. You're not, you're not half bad, if I do say so myself. Kira says, Half-Life, Full-Life Consequences, Level AI Writing. A well, question. I'm assuming that game does not have good communication, good good uh, dialogue. <laughs> Ooh, okay. This one, uh, you're good Which at. of these elements on the periodic table, ooh, I just, ooh, I, my heart got a little flutter. Which of these elements on the periodic table is represented by consecutive letters of the alphabet? So, like, letters are, like, right next to each other? Mm, yes. Okay. Um, so, tungsten is, I believe, actually from the Latin wolfram, so mm -hmm. it's actually represented with the letter W. Okay. Manganese is M, M N. Okay. so there we go, that's a good... That's Lead it. is actually used in the Latin plumbum, which is a rather humorous word, as a, according to Patton, mm -hmm. which is actually PB. And helium is just H-E. H -E. So that wouldn't, easy. that wouldn't work. So I'm believing it's actually going to be manganese. Sounds, yeah, and I think the chat is agreeing too, so correct, correct. maybe on the right track here. Um, we have a number of people saying helium. Uh, I'm pretty sure that that is that not is, correct. I don't think that would be right. So we're going to go manganese. I'm choosing B. Now, if it was H and I, that would, that would have been different, but is, right? I think you're is right. Mm. Your final mm. answer? That's my final answer. That's that my final answer. That is his final answer. That's my final answer, not Regis. That's our final oh, answer. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct Oh, I thought answer. he was going to be like, oh, man. That's the Yeah. One. Very well done. That Very was well the done. right answer. Very well, thank you. Very well awesome. I, see, I appreciate you handshaking. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah what I do next time says, question. Logan, you're so no, silly. I love question. you. You, you is mind. a silly guy. Ashley, I really need you to work on your grammar. I do appreciate it, but please, 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 that grammar. Devil's Coach Horse is the name of a species of what? Now this oh, is fascinating. That is fascinating. I do not know the answer, but I am very eager to know the answer to this. Tortoise, crab, snail, or beetle? If you had a guess, which one would you think it would be? Honestly, something out of the ordinary, like a beetle would Probably. Strangely enough, I was thinking beetle yeah, as well. Yeah, I don't know, because if, imagine if there was a bug named the devil's a coach horse. That would be amazing. Hmm. Um, do you think we should do another lifeline on this Could one? be another lifeline. We have snail, we have crab. Devil's coach horse. We could do 50-50. We could do 50-50, although I don't know if that would help me narrow it down, because there are none on here that I absolutely know yeah, aren't that's fair. the thing. Do you know what I mean? Uh, beetle. A lot of folks are saying A lot of people beetle. are saying beetle. Devil's coach horse. Snail seems too obvious. Could be. Well, maybe. Um, we're so close to getting the bare minimum right. of $32,000. So, of course, a phone call wouldn't hurt either. We could try a phone call. Do you think some people would know what a devil's coach horse is? What is the phone call going out to? Uh, let's find out. Let's find out. Let's give it a go. What's the worst? Why thing not? Happen? There's no real money involved in this. Oh, unfortunately. Let's make this happen. 
Alright, so uh, phone a friend. Go ahead and select the uh, Oh, I'm okay. in control. Yeah. We are never better All right. served than by our friends. Very true. You choose to call one. We have a number of people saying have crap. Phone right now. Alright, what do we got? Oh, we get to pick. Devil's coach. Oh, we get to pick? Oh, yeah. between these four people who we've never met. Wife Tina? This is George's wife, Tina. I forget that I'm not actually this person. <laughs> um, colleague might know it. A childhood friend. Ooh. Or an aunt. Who would know what the devil's coach horse would be? I'm gonna say, and, and, and I'm pretty sure that there's not gonna be actually any standard dialogue. It's just gonna be them picking. Probably, but. Let's go with Jennifer the colleague. colleague. That sounds smart. That sounds collegiate, yeah, right? Yeah, why not? What's the yes, worst hello? that can happen? Who is this? There's Hello, dialogue. this is Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? And we the need timer. your help. Oh. Well, I hope I'm up to the task. But we'll get through it for sure. Oh, Let's go. This dialogue. Yeah. A is the right answer, I think. Uh-oh. She she barely took any time on that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um... So she sounded not interested in helping. No. But she is saying crab. Um, Ines says, I'll go with crab because it's red. So we're between beetle and crab. Do we want to do a 50-50? Uh, I have a feeling if we do, we'll keep beetle and <laughs> we'll crab. But you know two. what? You want to try? You know what? Let's do it. Let's do you know it. Let's just, Why let's the go. hell not? Okay, let's get risky. Random wrong answers and leave the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. All right, here we go. <gasps> Got oh. <laughs> can, uh, they, can, they, can they hear us? Can they hear us? Uh, maybe. Woo! All right, we are between beetle and crab. Uh, There's, okay, the chat is saying beetle. Let's go with beetle. I did not like that woman. I like them a lot more. Okay. And if we're all wrong, the chat won't be too mad at us. No, and we can always try it again. D Easy. We can. Pretty good. Let's go, we're doing I'm a beetle. Say D. Really, um, really mad at that. If we're, cor if we're right. correct, I'll really be very impressed. Yes, sir. And then we'll um, drop our colleague forever. That's my final answer. He's gonna really, he's gonna really make us sweat this out. Thank you, Restark. Thank you, Restark. You given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. Thank you. Well, you just yeah. Oh! Our colleague was absolutely Get wrong. Get your colleague. Was this is absolutely wrong. That's okay. This is why you took six years on a two-year college course. You know why it's okay? Pressure. Because she question. doesn't actually exist. That's true. So, Ooh. what nationality is the sing? Uh, and congratulations to everybody Thank in the you, chat. chat. By the way, Thank sorry you to the chat. we doubted you. Some of you may be googling, and. I gotta say, really be careful with that. Yes. What nationality is the singer Nana Muscori? The name is giving me Turkish or Greek. That's I, what it's giving I me. I feel it's more Turkish, perhaps. You think it's, um, well, Turkish, yes, um, potentially. We've got, oh, oh, oh. Oh, we have oh, someone that says Greek. We have somebody yelling out Greek. Caitlin Marie says absolutely Greek. Wow, we have somebody with a very Greek name yelling Greek. Okay. Kenny, I think we're gonna have to go Greek. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to go Greek too. Which is very appropriate no more for the video that's going I'm out tomorrow. Say D. Yeah. We're gonna you know we're gonna lock we're gonna is, lock right? that in. Is this your final answer? Wait, my dad went to. Oh, oh. I'm so sorry. Yes, I feel bad for saying that's that now. That's my final answer. <laughs> the choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. Come on. <laughs> this That's dialogue. Very good. Before. Very, very good. Well done. Thank you, chat. Thank you, chat. We are up to 64,000. That, that was a good, like... Yeah, that was very other. good. I'm so glad that we had a... What I would imagine really? to be a the literal answer Greek answer person in our chat telling us well? that. Last checked with Pat... This is an individual named um, Midnight Moon. Last checked with Patton. You the mom to his dad? No, that is absolutely I, absurd, I don't know. Midnight I don't Moon. Even but know th what that means. thank you for your super chat. <laughs> You're absolutely absurd. Which of Batman's enemies carves a tally mark on himself with each new victim? Now, oh. Thomas did watch a lot of Gotham. Yes. And he did play the Arkham series. So actually, I do know this one, and yes. it's Victor's Victor ass. Shot. Yes. I know, I know that, that one too. Be. I do appreciate all these Batman questions. The yes, I know. There's, there's a lot of Batman all. questions on this is one. This your final Shocked. answer. We're greeking out. Thank you, Ashley. That'll be yes. my yes. final answer. I, I don't appreciate the pun, but I do appreciate the enthusiasm. I appreciate it. Now it's time anything. to don't worry about it. Kenny, don't make me lose respect in you. Yes, sir. Of course. <laughs>
one right we are these doing rivers. very well <laughs> we're doing very well our combined knowledge is getting us through it uh -huh. this new question is now waiting for you to be answered with flying colors we're all up to date looks like we're all up to date with the super chats if i'm not then let me know we had a lot of people saying victor they knew victor which of these characters is not an elephant in the TV show, The Lion Guard. Now that is a Disney Plus cartoon yes. based around The Lion King, correct? Which is actually not a bad show, believe it or not. Correct, yes. Mm -hmm. Now I'm a little bit miffed that there are potentially three elephant characters in this Lion Guard three? show. That seems like an excess of a storytelling technique of, of characters. So I am at a complete loss. And this is our $250,000 question. Yeah. Do we want to switch this question out? Let's see what the chat says. Maybe the chat can help us out. Keep in mind, the chat can Google things. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, let's switch it out. Do we want to? Do we want to play fair? Yeah, let's play fair. And if we can't, then we'll. Yeah, let's try switching let's switch it, out. it out. We're switching it out. We are not lying. I'm just curious to see what they say. Lifeline well used. Oh. Okay. Well, Sockway. None of us would have known that. To be no, I would never have guessed that. Yeah. Moving on. Will you be able to answer this new question as oh, well? Oh, no. Uh-oh. Canada. A very Canada. big blind spot for me. Uh. Cape Breton Island is part of which Canadian province? Now, for whatever reason, I'm leaning towards Nova Scotia or Prince Edward Island, like it's an Ooh. offshoot of another island. And I have friends in Canada, and I wish I can call them for help, but... I know. Use now, now we may need our Canadian now, chat. Any Canadian pals Any Canadian in the chat? chats in the, in the chat? Um, uh, Sclumsy says, hi, Logan. Hello, Sclumsy. Oh, we have somebody we saying have Nova Scotia. Nova Any Nova Canadians Scotia? in chat? Alex Golseth says, wait, hold up. I'm Canadian. Oh, really? And I had just imagined them walking down the street one day to the store and having that realization. Wait, hold up a minute. <laughs> Wait a I'm second. I'm Canadian. Do we have an answer from, from Alex? Oh, we have a number of people saying Nova Scotia. God bless you. Pardon me. Sorry. God bless you. Pardon me. Oof. So let's, that was my instinct. Yep. If we're wrong, Fine we're choosing wrong. choosing B. It was a we've, good run. We've, we've made it. We've made it a good long way. Yes. Um, that's my final answer. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Riveting. This is riveting. He's gonna say some nonsense. Uh -huh. Yep. There we go. Now like he did. The There's the, the nonsense right. dialogue from oh, not Regis Philbin. Got it. I almost felt compelled oh, to give you one of those perfect. high fives. It's all right. Oh. I won't be mad. I've given high fives before. Given one to Roman before. Concentrate. I bet that was tough. There's a new question for you. A little tricky. Ooh. What, what color is the cross on the Finnish flag? I thought they completed it at least. <sighs> hmm. Oh, that's very not what it means. Sincere pattern vibes. Sorry. Rubs off what on color me. <laughs> is the cross on the Finnish flag? Now, I believe Finland is a blue flag with a right. yellow cross. Am I correct? That was white. I don't. I don't think it's white, but I'm like. For whatever reason, that's what I'm seeing. Unless I'm thinking of Norway. Oh 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 oh! Oh, oh we have blue. a number so of were... people saying blue. Wow, and I'm assuming that there are Europeans in the chat. I mean, most likely. I'm probably yes. thinking of a different flag. I'm probably thinking of one that goes to a completely maybe. I I don't know which one I might be thinking of. Uh, Kim Wilson says blue queen. So, I'm being called a queen. I, that's a compliment. I appreciate the respect. We're going to go with I'm blue because that chat knows it. Yes. This you chat knows it. Convinced, but is Let's play fair. Two seconds answer. later, let's check the chat. JB, yes. that is my line of, <laughs> that is my line of action. Correct. Now it's time to find out the correct So, answer. Finland would be white flag with blue cross, I'm assuming. Probably. You took the time. There you go. But you are right. You took the time. One more but right answer right? for me. There's no time limit, though. But you are right. Our last question. We got. We this. made it all the way to the end. Yes. By Through ourselves. Just completely by ourselves. Yes. That's dishonest. Will you be able to answer this new this question? This chat has helped Ooh. us out quite a bit. All right. It's time for your expertise on this. Ah, one. Fallen Angel says yellow is Sweden. Ah, oh, Sweden. Interesting. 
Which of these is a family of subatomic particles? Hmm. <laughs> All right. Which of these is a family of subatomic particles? This is a very good question. Right. My first instinct is leptons. I don't know why. What is pyramid? What does that mean down there? Pyramid? It just shows you how many questions you have left. Oh, this that is clearly not a pyramid. Mm, technically Clearly no. not a pyramid. That is not the shape of a pyramid. That angers me. Fluorons, quarons. See, I feel like B is just a playoff of quarks. Yeah. But I could be wrong. What makes, yeah. What makes we have sense? some, oh boy, and we do have some people saying leptons. Quarons. We have some people saying quarons. We have one person saying fluorons. Hmm. One said falsehood, which is not one of the answers. But good try, though. Reno says, what is family? And that's just... I think that's a little bit sad. It's okay. We're all here for you. Do you want to just say leptons and just... Yeah, you know what? And if Let's we fail... Let's just go out with a bang. We at least we win could, something. We could walk away with the 500,000. True. <laughs> uh, leptons might be a space a you space know thing. Let's leave and then whatever answer... And never come back. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so there is a leave option right on the top if you want to do it. Lepti, lep, lepti, lepti is not. Lepti. You know, it's fake money. You let's just go with leptons. Yeah, let's do it. Nothing ventured, nothing, nothing gained. Exactly. We go if we I'm go home, we go D. home with the same amount of money that we would have otherwise gone exactly. home. Exactly. <laughs> Very good it. point. You know, final answer. good logic. Hey, that'll be go. my Thank final you. answer. Calling me good. <laughs> what is it going to be? And you I truly don't know choice. if the chat agrees with me or not. The chat was. <gasps> we have a new. Appreciated getting that one right. Wow. Okay. That's amazing. And I gotta be honest with you, didn't actually anticipate getting a, uh, a million dollars at the I game. I know. End game, too. I can't wait to tell the other sides. So that is very exciting. That's a laugh and a half. Thank you for the super chat. Wanted to say my partner, Axby, really likes you. Well, I appreciate that, dear friend. Thank you so much. Um, the chat is celebrating. The chat is having a good time. Lots of woos, lots of yas. Well dang from Nick. Kenny is over here having a great old time. That's fantastic. Kenny, do we want to play again? Let's do it again. We're playing play again. It. Mr. Mellon says, let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you to everyone in the chat. I am high-fiving you all, and I do not high-five. So I'm high-fiving all of you figuratively in this chat. Uh, Akumatize Virtus Slay. Slay. And I do know what that means. All right, so we're pressing a, a button to continue. Very, very nice. Wonderful. Okay. And we simply goes again. All right. I'm gonna check something out I'm here excited, I'm excited about this. Oh, oh. Oh, we got some new, oh, uh... Oh, oh, oh. we have one for general culture. What is that? I don't know. Lunar but... says, good job, Logan. Thank you, Lunar. Thank you to all of you. Good job to all of you. You all definitely got us through several of those questions. And all we've got some right. figurative high fives back to me. Thank you so much. Thank you. You know, I think I think winning that game warrants them a falsehood. I agree. They've earned it. They've waited. Shall we've, we do it in unison? Let's, let's make a falsehood happen. Yeah, let's do it oh, together. please, Kenny, feel free to join me. Right. Not often do I get company with the falsehoods. Now, you have very... Um, High tech microphones. Yes, so we should be we'll good. count down. Let's make sure that everyone feels good with their which way should we their point? volume. I'm gonna count down, and if you all want to uh, cover your ears or take the headset away from your ears, do that. Ready? You're pointing in this direction. Wonderful. Let's do yep. it. On three, two, one. Falsehood. <laughs> felt good. It felt good. Very nice. <laughs> I love that everyone appreciates a good falsehood every now and again. Um, Thank you to Froggy Yoshi for your super chat. I appreciate that. Your first one. Nice. Wonderful, wonderful. It's a cute icon too. Midnight Moon says, let's hope that game volume isn't too low again. And I, you just tricked me into saying a pun. Thank uh -huh. you so much, Midnight Moon. <laughs> Ashley says, now that you've won a million dollars, Logan, would what would you spend that money on? He's going to say Crofters, isn't he? Well, you don't know me, Ashley. Some of it will go to crofters, yes. Inevitably, it always will. But probably I will invest it. 
and turn that into and a, you know some other some other money and because after stock after taxes they take a big chunk of it oh, you know yeah, absolutely so it's we all have to really keep that in mind with our investments invest spend wisely and maybe somewhere down the road we'll use it for a nice little fun purchase to that a trip would be. a trip to Wales there we Why go Wales well, because there was an individual from Wales and oh. I was doing a callback, as it were. You know what? Were. Very good. Very, very good. Uh, James says, Virgil was right. Do you know about MBTI? Yes, the Myers-Briggs uh, test, test... Institute? Institute, yes. I heard um, it and I'm glad that I, I guessed their other favorite side. I knew, it, I knew it so well. Oh, and look, we have a bunch of falsehoods in the chat. Yeah, I think our falsehood everyone else was, was saying, successful. Everyone else was saying falsehood in the chat as well. Thank you so much for joining. Do we want to jump back in? Shall we? We're going to deselect Olympic Games. Oh, oh. what did I just do? Uh, yeah, we, you just do it without timer. Escape back. Oh, no, no, you're fine. Go ahead. Oh, I, yeah, you just oh, click okay. on it to select Without it. timer. Okay, Kenny had it right. It's all good. Olympic Games, we're switching off. We're taking off soccer slash football. Sorry, guys. And then that's it. Yeah, we're all right, ready. Boom. Let's uh, okay. Uh, a dusty book. Yippee! Yippee! Welcome to you, a dusty book. <laughs> Thank you so much for the super chat. Um, Should we do a new character? Let's try a different yeah, character. Let's try someone else we, out. George. Oh, okay. I love Nadia. Nadia's pretty. Hang. Oh, I like the cardigan. That is very smart cardigan. Yes. Chun. Everyone looks ready for this game. Pablo. He likes tap dancing. And, and she likes mini golf. Look at us with this. Ooh, well, I do, do like Margaret's energy. We, I think we should do Margaret. You want to do Margaret? Let's do yeah, Margaret. Let's do it. She Passion mini is golf. mini golf. That is absolutely inane and silly and erroneous. But it's I like Margaret anyway. I mean, when you're retired, I mean, what what can you do? When you're retired, what can you do? Lots of things, Kenny. Lots of things. Like mini golf. <sighs> sure. <laughs> sure. Jaden says, "How Logan, how do you feel about the color orange?" Average, normal, typical. It's a good show, too. Kira, thank you for the super chat. You have a falsehood soundboard button on your PC. Wow, I wonder what soundboard, you what sounds would be on those. On who wants to be a millionaire? Oh, you they, said we that didn't. Last we time. we got to change the player, but we didn't switch up the host. That's wonderful. Uh, That's great. Really appreciate. That's nice. Well, no applause for when Margaret came out. My belt. If that's not enough to win, I don't know what is. Well, Margaret, please. Ready? Hubris Let's play. comes Who before the fall. A millionaire? Sounds right to me. I'm not going to argue with that. Fifteen questions to reach the million. <laughs> We will well, climb this money ladder. We're climbing this step by tower. Step. Wow, ladder. Not pyramid. pyramid. I like ladder. Do That's good. It yeah, does look like a ladder. Why didn't they call it a ladder? I, I would take ladder 50 -50. Probably over a, a pyramid. Maybe it's a patent license thing, perhaps, but I don't know. Your girl Tam says, I love you, Logan. You are Our the best side. Well, thank you, your girl Tam. You a new question. I'd like to think of myself as that. Ooh. Maggie has Moxie says, Canada mention. Yes, there was a mention of Canada. Who was president of the United States in 2001? Well, that's definitely George W. Bush. George W. Bush. Yep, I remember. Gordon that. W. Cops. They couldn't come up with like actual other names of presidents. I'm choosing George B. W. Schrock. I know that it is the $100 question. Right. But come on. At least be somewhat creative. George or at least W. Factual. Bush. You sure? He might as well been Jeff yes, W. Shrub. Final answer. Jeff W. Shrub. I just now understood. It's a different, yeah. it's a different it's growth correct. of leafy <laughs> growth. Oh boy. Yep, that would have been. That would, I would have been upset but if we got that one wrong. Right. I've seen some episodes where they get the wrong answer, answer like wrong Aha. like that quickly. They answer it like too fast. Oh yes. Like, Here's a new question. And it is embarrassing. You. Yes. What's normally seen above a pair of crossbones on the Jolly Roger flag? The Jolly Roger flag. Silly, silly name. But I do know that it is a skull. Yes. Because it's a very popular um, thing well, to put on a pirate ship. I'm going ship. to try A. Although that is not what final? the uh, flags looked like in our flag means death. Answer. True. It was different. All oh, right. Tiffany Marinelli, Let's thank you for your right super chat. Together. That is wonderful. Logan, I love you on the other sides. Do you have a good book That's recommendation? We I just finished That's my right. book series. Now, I may have given this book recommendation That's before, but I highly good. recommend The Seven and a Half Deaths of Evelyn Trust Hardcastle. It is an incredible novel. Question. The mystery in that book is 
incredible and you just it keeps you guessing all the way through i need a good new book anyway so this is perfect seven and a half deaths of evelyn hardcastle is a part sci-fi part agatha christie part groundhog's day a person wakes up in a in a big mansion as a different person every day and relives the same day uh, uh, at a party and is trying to solve a murder that's amazing that happens at the end of the day I love it is that. incredible. It is an incredible book. Tiffany, if you give it a read, let me know what you think. Which film features the song Ding Dong, The Witch is Dead? Oh, I like this one. This that is, is Hocus Pocus? Uh, not quite. It's I put a spell on you. The Wizard of Oz is Ding Dong, The Witch is Dead. I will defer to you because I don't care for any of this what nonsense. Oh, your well, final answer. That case. <laughs> Wizard of Oz. Um, that's my final answer. Silly. Rugi Yoshi says, E, hi again. Happy late birthday, Logan. Well, it's an appreciation day. Froggy Yoshi, just, no, I'm just clarifying, just not to be pedantic. Uh, and love you, love you back, Froggy. Although I, I don't know you very well, I will say that I, I care for you and your support. River51815 says, can you say hi to my friend, Isa? They love you. Hello, Isa. And thank you so much for the super chat, River. Appreciate it. What is Kitty Pride's main power? Ah, X-Men. Oh. Well, it's not shape-shifting. No. Oh, intangibility. She oh, can right. phase through objects. That's so I'm right. going to say it's that. He seems quite appropriate to me. Final answer. I about that character. I you remember sure? her now, but... I'd be very impressed if Margaret would know answer. the answer to that question. I agree. I mean, she does have 60 years of okay. experience the on there, so... the computer validated your answer. Yes, oh. absolutely. Hey, that question almost drove me crazy. Didn't look it. Sandra says, I can't super chat, but if you see this, then thank you for all the memories you brought. I wish the Vine hadn't died. Well, Sandra, Vine didn't die. It's an app. And everyone on it is still making things. So you can still watch all of their content yes. everywhere else. And I hope that you enjoy it. Thank you, though. Which of these is not a corner space in the board game Monopoly? Oh. OK, so I know Famous there's game. Go. There is Go. And there's... Go, in and of itself, is another board game. Yep. Free parking, go to jail, and income tax. Can't stand that income tax. Okay. But Ain't that is true. the answer. It's D, I think. It's D. OK. I know you are waiting for me to ask you, so let's go. Is this your final answer? Um, that's my final answer. All right, let's see if this works. You have given your final answer. You know my monopoly. I hope it is the right one. Everyone, yes, lots of people in the chat knew income tax as well. So you are in good shape. There you are. Everyone's, everyone's doing great on this on this on this round. I know. Absolutely it's time killing to it. Move on to a new Figuratively. Mm -hmm. It's okay. What series tells the story of Sam Tyler, a detective from 2008 who wakes up in 1973 after a car accident? Well, this definitely sounds like my kind of show, and I believe it's Quantum Leap because there is all sorts of time travel that happens in that show. Yeah. Um, wakes up in 2008. It's not Timeless. Timeless was another show Thomas was very into, and it, it really ended before its time. Yeah. Fringe is more about supernatural events that happen. I don't know if there's time travel that happens in that show. Not that I know of. And Life on Mars, I have no knowledge about. We could do a 50-50 just to be sure, because yeah. the show is really about, a uh, Quantum Leap is about a man who every episode jumps to different time periods. Right. So we could try a 50-50. Um, some are saying life on Mars, and some say are saying quantum leap. You want to do a 50-50? Yeah. Let's, Let's do a 50-50. Okay, Big. shift is how you do that. Okay. Yep, but I got you. 50-50. Let's, Let's try that just to be sure. Correct answers. Oh. There we go. It's life on Mars. Because it's definitely not timeless. Yes. I know what timeless is. And too bad if I'm wrong. No, not really. Correct, I mean, Margaret. Correct. You sure? Money Interesting. Does I'd love to see what my life yes, on Mars is like. It sounds answer. like my kind of show. Yeah. Oh, I can't wait time to travel. See the correct love answer. it. Well done. Thank you for everybody in the chat. Thank, Thank you. you for everybody in the chat. I'm glad Appreciate we did it. that because we would have gotten that you one can wrong. Tell. Oh. Parker says, Logan, what did you think of the Loki finale? And here's a new question. And I actually I do like enjoy Loki because there's time travel and all sorts of science. 
and it was amazing. It was incredible. Have you watched it? I yet? still need to see. It. I've oh. seen season one, but oh, season Kenny, two. Kenny, it's, season two, like just as good as season one, and it's what a story! Good. What I, a story! I have I have no plans this weekend, so that's gonna Ooh. be perfect. Ooh. Ooh. All right, so we have who starred in the 1995 film Jumanji. I know this and one. And this is near and dear to both of our hearts, correct? Absolutely. Robin Williams. All three of us, actually, because Thomas okay. likes this. Thomas, Thomas absolutely likes you. this, that even I wouldn't be able Here's to get that wrong. This is our Jumanji. That will be my final answer. The choice is made. Well, I hope with her 60 years And it's the superior Jumanji. Yes. Superior. No disrespect to the others. No disrespect, but this is the superior. Exactly. And I think even the actors in the new movie would probably agree. And boom. Very fair. One more answer. Although Aha. I will say, Jack Black's performance. Oh, absolutely. Is really good. Absolutely. Really Top good. Tier. Are you ready to face the traps of this next question? Traps. Good luck to you. What city does the action of the series The Wire take place? Oh boy. Oh, well, she did the same thing I just did. <laughs> My guess would be Chicago. My guess would be Chicago. Liar. Um, and I appreciate everyone who's, who agrees in regards to Jumanji. I love that they withheld, warned to do next time's comment of Jack Black as a silly man. We're yeah, gonna show that. I don't that. understand that either. We're gonna show that comment. <laughs> um, all right, we have one person saying Baltimore. We have two people saying Chicago. We could do <gasps> We have, oh, well, we have Aaron in the chat. And Aaron, I trust Aaron's judgment. Aaron says Baltimore. And I, that's surprising to me, but I'm gonna, that's my phone a friend. All right. So I'm gonna say Baltimore. Let's do it then. He seems good to me. <laughs> this, okay. Sorry, Aaron, this is all on you. Although there's all, all there's other commenters saying Baltimore. <laughs> that's my final answer. I'm gonna put it all on Aaron. Go. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. There you go. The she was right. Answer. Wonderful. Or they were right. Boondaba. Boondaba. Oh, no, Boondaba. You really need to scare me like that, okay? Thank you, Margaret. Yeah, for no real. one like, needs that. Yeah. No one needs it. Now <sighs> let's go to the next question. Pineapple Rat says the Atlantic want. Ocean. I don't believe that was even an answer. That was an <laughs> option, Pineapple Rat. Who played John Voight's friend in the 1969 film Midnight Cowboy? I, I believe, oh, I am between Billy Crystal and Dustin Hoffman. Billy Crystal active in 1969? <laughs> was he active? Was he active? active? Um, he probably was moving around. Well, well, active, yes, but like in the act. Acting? acting? One of those old movies that right. Thomas has never taken a chance on. <laughs> Cut. Very fair. Um, do we want to do a ask the audience? You know Maybe what? an ask the audience knows Let's this. Let's do it. Let's ask the audience. Let's see okay, if they can surprise audience, us. We need some help here. Here we go. If you here we are. Up those keypads here we go. And enter your votes now. Here we go. And we have <gasps> Dustin Hoffman. A Midnight Cowboy. Was that the I'm walking here? I'm walking here. Quote. Probably. Poss possibly. I thought it was City Slickers. I don't know. Maybe it was. Maybe you're right. Maybe but you you're right. Maybe it was. Dustin Hoffman could work. Is we have somebody right? blatantly admitting that they're cheating. Caitlin Moraine <laughs> saying Wikipedia says Hoffman. Well, there you go. Thank I mean, you, that, Caitlin. I mean, that's my technically answer. we did ask the audience. So I know now yeah. who to avoid looking at when I'm looking at the chat. Answer. I hope it is the right one. Me too. Well done. You got it. Oh, we got it. Oh, egg. It's already midnight. I think I'm gonna go to sleep. If you need some sleep, please, please definitely get some rest. I highly encourage that. This new question. Oh, I might have missed Mars's super chat. Mars, I might have missed your super chat. I thought I was all caught up with super chats. If I didn't, please let me know. Where are the Mars super chats? There was a lot. There was a lot that yeah, came in at the very beginning. Today. Oh, wow. Quantine. Oh, hey, There's yeah. a lot of people in the chat giving appreciation and love for you. So I'm just going to leave the super chat here as a reminder of their appreciation. My dog, Gabby, is also watching the, this video. Aww. She appreciates you too. It's Quantine, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. That That's means awesome. a lot. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is wonderful. 
Wonderful, Love wonderful, that. and it is very, I very much appreciate it. There's a super chat from Mars. Hey, Logan, how do you feel about David Tennant coming back to Doctor Who? Oh, love you. Tell Virgil I said hi. I shall do that, Mars, although he's always reticent to, yes. to receive any highs. But, oh my goodness, yes. Uh, do you yes. know? Do you yes, know? Absolutely. Are you caught up? Yep. David Tennant is coming back, That's along a, with Donna. That's a huge surprise. With, with, it's, the, it's the absolute dream team it's of the, Doctor Who and and friend. I don't think anyone and else companion. could that, really. David Tennant and, and Donna are top tier Doctor Who. If you've never watched Doctor Who, just watch those episodes. Watch that show. It's amazing. And nothing else. And you, and I can't, oh, I can't even form words. It's it's incredible. <laughs> it makes me so happy. And I forgot that it was happening. So when Jodie Whittaker transformed into David Tennant, I lost my mind, figuratively. Oh, I bet. But pretty much close to. Thank you for everybody. Everyone's super chats, everyone's support in the chat today has been incredible. Thank you so much. I don't know if it's because I'm here, Probably. but I really, really genuinely appreciate all of that support and love. Uh, I can't tell you, it's it's a wonderful, wonderful thing. <laughs> all right, going back to the question at hand, yes. which of these was a former occupation of Whoopi Goldberg? Ooh. I actually do not know any of the tri trivia about Whoopi Goldberg, except that Whoopi is a nickname that was given to her because she passed gas quite a bit. Really? Mm -hmm. And that was something that her friends nicknamed her, Whoopi. That's all I know about Whoopi Goldberg. Okay, that's... It's a fascinating trivia. Also great. that she would do USO shows with Robin Williams and Billy Crystal. Yes. Wonderful, wonderful lady. And in a very popular movie... Call Her Purple. That and Ghost. And Sister Act. And Sister Act too. There's, she, she's in a lot of them. And a, okay, and a lots of love, a lots of love from people in the chat. Thank you so much. Okay, we only have people that are just guessing here. Mortuary beautician. Somebody in the chat thinks that it's mortuary beautician. Rose does. Um, now I could see her being a slaughterhouse secretary. Mm -hmm. What even is a library exterminator? What is that? What is a synagogue janitor? Is there something to exterminate in a library? I think so. It feels like they're putting two words together randomly. Yeah. Like all of, which I, of these was a, oh, oh, oh. What's that? Which of these was a former, I'm so sorry. I thought that the question was, which of these was not a former occupation? Oh. Of, and so I'm thinking, she was three out of the four of these? <laughs> I that was would be impressive. very confused. Okay. Well, a lot of folks are saying. Okay, which uh, of these was a former occupation of Whoopi Goldberg. Now right. it's making sense because I was so thrown off by some of these. So a lot of people are saying mortuary beautician. I don't know what a library exterminator is. I don't that think a lot you would of I, I think you would be an exterminator or you would work in a library. Right. I don't know if you'd explicitly hire an exterminator just for libraries. I don't think bookworms are that prevalent. Nah. Except, you know, the figurative bookworms, oh, the of frequent course. libraries. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. And a slaughterhouse secretary. What is that? I'm gonna say mortuary beautician. Yeah, it actually what? makes sense. What's the worst thing? That would be a thing. Oh, oh this one. You're good. Too many. The best too many mice. Answer is C, no doubt. Well, agree with Margaret. Thank you, Black Bow Burnham. Thank you so much for the super chat. The very first one. Appreciate that. Their this very first your, one. Lots of answer. first super chats. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Dominica. Good night to you. You reached that threshold. Oh. We got it. It was the only one that made any sense. Somewhere. We reached the threshold. Yes. So no matter what, we're taking home thirty-two thousand imaginary dollars. The game dollars is off to a probably good never going to see in but real life. Shouldn't stop there. In Here what year was Alfred Hitchcock thriller Psycho first released? That's an older movie. Definitely Very an older classic. Movie. A classic horror. Movie. First movie that featured a toilet. Too yes. Stopped. A toilet flushing. I have to calm down. Uh, Margaret does need to stress out because at her age, it could be okay. all over any second. Let's get back. Literally. <laughs> Literally. In That's what kind of it, dark, but it's kind of dark. Um, 1955 or 1960? Well, is what I'm thinking. It was in black and white, and because during mm -hmm. the during the infamous scene in the shower, when spoiler alert, up ahead, so be warned for that one. When she died, it looked like there was a lot of blood. However, since there was no technicolor during that time, they used chocolate syrup to match the consistency and the thickness of blood. Yes. 
And I always am marveling at that because I just didn't know chocolate syrup existed in the whatever year this was made. Who'd have thought? Who would have thought? Uh, Kara Cunningham, thank you for the super chat. Hi, Logan. Thought you'd be proud to hear I completed my first three shifts as a student nurse this week. Ooh. Well done to you, Kara. Props also, you. thanks for getting me through the last 10 years. Whew. That is Ten years. wild. That's amazing. Much love from New Zealand. Oh, love, love New Zealanders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. New Zealand. Thank awesome. you so much. Um, we have a couple people that are guessing 1960. Now, I would imagine it could be 1960. Yeah, there were still that's... lots of black and white movies. Yeah, because that's like a sweet spot between transitioning from black and white to technicolor. Correct. So, there was definitely still uh, Twilight Zone was making use of black and white for a lot. I would I would say 1960. You want to say? Yeah. And the fashion feels yes. like it was 1960. Oh, I agree. Absolutely. You know, I would Hair even style. venture to say 1965, but I think that he was making other movies like The Birds and other right. things by 1965. So let's go with 1960. If we're wrong, we're wrong. C seems good to me. Okay, C. Who is Cece? Answer. Why is she good to you? Yes, I don't know. Cece's good to me. CC is good to me. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. Here we go. Hey! Yeah. Yeah. Good Amazing. Job. Right I mean, we, we've done a lot of high fives. <laughs> I, I will high five if we get back to a million. We'll yes, see. Yes, you know what? That's very fair. Oh, thank you, Froggy. Going to a driving no, lesson. Wish me luck. Bullshit. Yes, you please drive mind. safely, responsibly. Yes. Look ahead. Keep your eye on the road. Look wherever you're your going. Phone down. Look, put your phone down. Put your phone down. I see you. I see you with your phone. I don't really. I was, I was just trying to goof you out. <laughs> um, which animal is mentioned most often in the Bible? This Ooh. is very fascinating. Yes. Fascinating, fascinating answer. I don't think goat, and I don't think camel. No. I would say it's between sheep and lion, and I would probably say sheep because I, say I think sheep. Jesus referred to sheep quite a bit. Quite there were definitely lions. Daniel with his lions, but sheep were often used as sacrifices. Uh, there you go. That's another. That's another Lord. one. Yes, um, definitely. Sheep, sheep herding was used a lot. We're not feeling sheepish about the answer. Sheep. You made a pun. No, I'm just saying a word that is closely related to the word sheep. Okay. It's not a play on words. Okay. Let's, let's go. We can for still, sheep. you can still have fun with language and not do puns. <laughs> um, River says, "My friend didn't notice your first hello. Can you say hello, science? They might not. They might notice that. Hello, science. That's me. That we, I wake up every day saying hello, science. When I, you know, I'm getting ready to do my day. Um, everyone's saying sheep. Let's uh, go with sheep. Yep. I enjoyed and taking science B. classes in uh, high yes, school. B. Yes, the teacher was very good. So did Thomas. That. And I appreciated um, it. That's my final answer. <laughs> Except physics. Yeah. Physics was a lot of memorization. Not enough choices logic. Not being fun to time do. To discover the right it was just memorizing things. You there you go. Know we, knew, we knew our we, Bible animals. We've been new. We knew our, our, which is not something I thought I would say. Ready to face the traps of this next question? Wait. Good luck. Good, good job to everybody in the chat who guessed sheep. Uh, I want to do it next time says, I'm going to be real. I didn't know Alfred Hitchcock was a real name and not just the first part of Alfred Hitchcock Lucas. Oh, yes, wait, that, wait, is, uh, that is uh, that is another d director name. Huh. Oh. <laughs> Which trophy was donated by the sixth governor general of Canada? Ooh, oh, I dear. Don't know. I would most likely, seeing as how hockey is very prevalent up in Canada, yeah. I would say, I would wager a guess to the Stanley Cup. I would wager the Stanley Cup, That too. would be my guess. But I don't know. Yeah. Do we want to do a phone a friend? We could phone a friend. What, what, what else do we have? We have... We have... Uh, we have that and we have switch out the question. Yes. I don't want to switch out the question. This is our 125,000. No, start? no, no. This is a $250,000 question. Yes. Do we have people who are white wagering guesses? You're on the chat side. Yes. Uh, let's see. Once said this. Uh, yeah, some, some people are guessing Stanley. It makes it makes the most sense it for it to be Stanley. But I don't know what these other three are. Yeah, I don't either. Yeah, people are saying Stanley. I'm gonna go with Stanley. You know what? Why not? Let's let's use Worst our Worst case scenario, we have uh you know what? We're using 32, logic. imaginary dollars. Oh, hang on. Oh, okay, that. there we go. Yeah, exactly. Too it's, bad if I'm wrong. It's all you know fake. Very true. Too bad if we're wrong. 
Here we go. Let's see. That will be my final answer. See if yeah, everyone's got it. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. This dialogue is so bad. Hey, you're right. Good job. Amazing. I was so thrown off, I couldn't enjoy the correct answer because that dialogue was terrible. What are you saying, not Regis? What are you even saying with that statement? You're saying nothing. But you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. Any Sager, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Black Bo Burnham, what's the difference between a cat and a comma? A cat has claws at the end of its paws, and a comma has a pause at the end of its claws. Oh, very clever. And that is actually words. very clever. I do actually I like that. appreciate that. And thank you for knowing what a comma is. Yes. Uh, thank you for that, Black Bo Burnham. Thank you, Arvo Benedict, for your super chat. I was having a bad day, but when I saw that my favorite side, well, very much, was playing my favorite game, my day was immediately, be immediately Aww. better. Sorry for the stumbling on my words. Thank you for going live. Well, that's wonderful, that's Arvo Benedict. Nice I'm comment. very happy to have helped in this small fashion. Appreciate you appreciating this game. Luke says, I recently became blind and it's been tough to deal with, but your Aww. strategies for coping with things have been a huge comfort. Thank you so much, Logan. Good luck winning your imaginary dollars. Thank you so much, Luke. I, I'm, I can only imagine it's a it's a challenge to to accommodate and, and, and get adjusted to that new situation, but my goodness, you're doing it strong and I believe in you. And I we'll believe make in use, you. good use of our imaginary dollars for sure. Make, make a lot of good use of our imaginary dollars. Um, speaking of imaginary, Howo says people ship you with Remus, aka see you two as a couple. Blah. Oh, yeah. Yes, I Gross. did a super chat just to say that. Love you. Well, thank you, Howo, and we're moving on. <laughs> <laughs> Annie Sager says, hi, Logan. I was accepted into community college Let's well go. done, Annie. Very that good. is incredible. I appreciate that. Um, thank you for letting me know. Okay, what is the name of the Ooh. Count who kidnaps Reinhard's sister in Legend of the Galactic Heroes? And they only know. have his name and then Roman numerals. Three, four, five. So or that we're six. we're absolutely we got to switch out this question, right? This is this is not I a mean, good question. Yeah, I, I I don't like this. question. I don't like this question. This question stinks. Uh, we have a photo friend, but I I yeah, do not like this question. question. If I had to guess, I'll probably say five. It's time to use this. I mean, if, if I'm right, I will, I'll question. probably be done for the night. Let's see if this person was correct. This person said. Okay, good. Uh, I believe it's B. So Farah said it's B, and So Farah was correct. Well, Farah, good job. You Thank get, you, like, so Farah. Five hundred thousand imaginary place, dollars. You're going, good you're job. Going to make short work of yeah, this is everyone giving person. Annie her their kudos in the chat? Well done. Under which pseudonym did oh Ooh. she who shall not be named yeah. publish her Cormoran Strike series? First published in 2013. Uh, yes, ironically uh, using a male name as her author name. I believe it's Robert Galbraith. And We're I'm moving on. Me. Wish yes, I could have switched out of this question. We, uh, if I get it wrong, we don't, we don't know them. Thank goodness. Not my author. Yes, I didn't vote for them. Answer. Oh. The choice is made. You figured it out perfectly. Nice answer. <laughs> the Grace of Ebony says, wow, this is worse. <laughs> Good reaction. Last question. And we have one more left It's line. the last question. Here we go. It's the final question. Concentrate. Here's well, that, that, was, that was a bomb. That was nice. Ooh. <gasps> Who was the voice of the gay dog in South Park? Well, uh, I, didn't I am that. so sad that I know this, and I have not watched South Park. And Thomas hasn't either. D. Unless... Girl... Wait, I'm thinking. <laughs> Wait, I'm that was a little of Thomas coming out there. I was like, I didn't say that. It's definitely George Clooney. Ah, oh, yes. Final? <laughs> um, that's my final answer. That is her final answer. <laughs> I was like, don't select for me. Don't, yeah, I was like, how dare you? <laughs> I hope it it's is like, the don't right question one. his, uh... <clears throat> there you go! Let's go! We got two people million. We've got all our all our rainbow and trans flags in the comments. Well done, I appreciate that. Raise them high. Raise them high. <laughs> Dallas commented, Logan saying girl. I did not mean I did not mean to do that. The, I, we got her to imagine. We win! We win! High five! Yes! Yeah. High five! I did not know that knowing George Clooney voiced the gay dog in South Park 
would be the million dollar question. Never in your entire education. Incredible. Life this happen. Ryder Heiss, thank you for your super chat. That is wonderful. Have a good night and a fun game, guys. It's well, Ryder, this is I think that that is a wonderful note to end on. We did a I wonderful agree. those are two wonderful games. Lizzie, thank you for your super chat. Your super yeah, chat says this up here. And then, Hi, I just started uni, and you're really helping me through. Thank you for everything. Well, thank you so much, Lizzie. I really appreciate that. Oh, the headphones did a number on my yeah, head there a little bit. Yeah, we get used to it. Yeah, we, we'll, we'll get used to it. I'll, I'll style it back. I'll quaff it back into something that's a little bit more manageable. Yeah. And thank you all so much for... What a a two million, night. yeah, you're correct. Izzy says two million fake dollars. That is how much we, we earned. We got two people an early fa fake retirement. And thank you all to those of you in the chat that helped us, helped get us through a number of those questions. Yes. I, I do think the second game we were literally amazing. We love you, Logan. Abro says. Oh, well, there we go. All right. Oh, we're back in. We're amazing. We love you, Logan. Abro says. Oh, well, there we go. All right. Oh, we're back in. Yeah, okay. Sorry about we, that. We took a little pause because we wanted to make sure that um that everyone was able to still watch the stream. We dipped a Sorry little bit. Sorry about that, guys. It's all good, it's all good. Um, uh, but yes, and then we have, let's see here, one more Super Chat just came in. Um, Quantine says, just gonna call some peeps out for saying they love you. What a beautiful way Aww. of using a Super Chat. Kim Garion, Oak Tree, a king and queen, few options. Lissy, actual garbage. Chaos Bean, I am also calling out Caitlin Marie for using Wiki. Well done, oh, Quantine. No. What a legend. I love it. That was wonderful, Quantine. And thank you so much. Thank you for everybody. Oh, do we have the audio? Do we have the audio? Yeah, the audio is still You're on. muting it's it, just, It's just a... Uh, it's the, it's it's the, the, timing, it's the yeah. signal? Okay. Yeah, don't worry. Uh, you're good. Wonderful. Well, and yes, thank you so much for all of the wonderful, wonderful comments on here. The beautiful, beautiful comments uh, of support. Thank you so much. Um... As a little bit, also a little note to uh, what we're going to potentially be doing for next week. Uh, Thomas hinted at it for the uh, in his Instagram story, but we did get the news yesterday of Inside Out Two being yes. announced, along with an extra character named Anxiety. So Thomas is basically dropping whatever he was going to do next week. And he's going to make a little video that features the sides. Oh, that's going to be great. With that bit of news. And whatever that's going to be is what it's going to be. He's still figuring it out. Roman is in his room Wait, working is on it so right bad? now. Wait, is the audio bad? Hang on. Is it? Uh, it shouldn't be. Hang on. I, I think it's still... Or right, can you hear? Here, let me uh, let me check some now. Mm -hmm. real quick. Yep, yep, yep. Wow, I we have can, more yeah, Super Chats that. coming in. Yeah, see, there's people. There are there are people commenting on the on the. Oh, on, the there are people or? commenting on what I'm commenting on. Okay, okay. Writer uh, highs, writer uh, highs. Thank you so much for another super chat. Love you guys. Have a good night. Thank you, writer. Wonderful, Captain Sam. Thank you for your super chat. We'll forever remember the sheep pun you made, Captain Sam. Sam, I will not refer to you with your ranking. If you say that I used a pun there, it was just a little bit of I was using appropriate words. That's all I was doing. It was not a play on words. Oh, and Gracie says I passed my physics test. Congratulations, Gracie. Okay. Well, before before the internet does have any sort of other issues, we're going to make sure... Oh, yep, we do have... The audio is normal for me, but some people are experiencing no sound. Um, but hopefully when we have the playback, the sound will still exist for people. So that's what I'm hoping. Um... Thank you so much for everybody appreciating you coming here to the live stream, making it happen. Yep. Thank you so much for playing the game. Yeah, you guys may have to refresh if uh, if it still cuts out, mm, but yes. uh, it is working. The audio you is chapped. You just may have to refresh the, the page. Well, in the meantime, I'll sign off so that all of you won't have to grin and bear through any other audio issues or whatnot. Thank you so much for joining me. Yeah. Thank you, and I'm going to read out some commenters names and because I believe that's how people do this and then we'll sign off okay. does that work oh I wasn't sure if you were aware of this or not but if you look behind you I did see this salutations Logan and then you have e equals mc squared do you uh, know what all of those stand for it's uh I just had a name I just had a brain fart on the name because I knew what it was but I for some reason I just mm -hmm. had a brain fart like Albert Einstein 
Uh, yes. It is the equation for some kind of. Atom. I mean, I, <laughs> I'm just realizing I might not have it right, but I think it's energy equals a constant times the speed of light squared. That's what it is. Yep. I could be wrong though. Um, Ryder Heise again just refreshed. The audio works. No worries. Okay, oh, wonderful, good. Ryder. Thank you, guys. Look at that, Kenny. Kenny is correct. Thank um, you. Thank you. Oh, and oh, your mom network says I genuinely need so much luck for my English lit exam. Please send luck. Well, luck is simply a concept and is not actually real, but I will wish it to you. Best of luck in that regard. Get um, a healthy amount of sleep and make sure you eat breakfast before you go take the test. Oh, and riddle me this says, do you like riddles? I love riddles. I absolutely adore riddles. And this is by a commenter named The Riddle Factory. So that's go. exciting. I'm, I hope that you'll join for other live streams where we could potentially have riddles. So. Let me read off some names and then we can say, call it call it a night and please everyone get some rest and take yes. care of yourselves. Goodbye Phoenix, Stuart, Rose, Gracie Vatis, Wildernez, Poison, HDTV, Taika, Abby Felker, Child of Hades 300, love you 3000, Between TJ, Midnight Moon, AG, Aaron Lost, Ellie, Izzy, Akumatized Verge, Lauren Marin, Caitlin Marie, wiki user, Warn a dude next time. Alex in Wonderland, Riot, Espeon Kimmy, Jamie Raindrop, Scarlet Kindle, A Gay Mistake, Red Wolf 195, Lego Girl, Mars, Captain Sam, Aaron H, Queen Glimmer, Love My Lane, Kara Cunningham, Zoe Joe, and you can just fade it out as we go into this next part. Okay. Sir Stitches, Princey Alex, The Strangest Thing, Annie Sager, Salutations Logan, Lunar, Snowy Wolf, Dead Death Head Moth, Lemon, Quantine, Cheese Crime, and oh, okay, Kenny's pulling me away from the microphone. Oh, oh and, and oh, 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 and we gotta use our, our imaginary money. Have a good night, Come everyone. On. Let's oh. go buy a library exterminator. Oh, energy is mass times speed of light. That's okay. Oh, that's, that's right. That's what it is. Okay, and all I'm right. glad we clarified. And good night. Thank Bye. you all for joining. Let's spend our imaginary money. Let's yes. go. Yes. Yes.